we are Canadians. Or I can only assume that you're probably Canadian because you're listening to the CBC. So assuming you're Canadian, you know that we pay a lot of taxes. Like, have you ever had a bonus on your paycheck at work and because you made more, they taxed you more and it's like the bonus never even existed? It's like your bonus was the pokeroo of money. Like Humpty and Dumpty tell you it was there, but then your bank account tells you different. It's times like that when I think things like, F you, government. It's like, yo, government, I don't work so that I can give my money away. I work so that I can buy cool stuff like food and American apparel tank tops. Those moments are always hard, but then I think, wait, we pay taxes because we live in an awesome country with amazing social programs. Programs like the gun registry, which I really don't know how I would live without. Or public transportation, because hey, it gets me there, on time or not. But most important, and sarcasm aside, let's face it, we have one of the best healthcare systems in the world. Just ask Barack Obama or Michael Moore. And I'm totally down with universal healthcare. I think it's great, until I think about some of the people whose healthcare I'm covering. Like Stephen Harper. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. To be specific, we cover smokers' healthcare. Or in other words, we cover the healthcare of total morons. And in general, I don't like the idea of handing my money over to morons, unless I'm in the mood for Tim Hortons. Okay, you, you might be thinking, whoa, 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 th there's no need to call them morons. Well, if you're thinking that, you're probably a smoker and or a moron. Smoking is known to cause cancer. Lung cancer, mouth cancer, cancer of the tongue, the gums, the throat. It's not like, oh, maybe smoking causes cancer, like maybe masturbation causes blindness. It's like smoking definitely causes cancer. So these people know what they're doing, and they also know, as Canadians, that when they need it, people like you and me will be there to pay for their medical bills. Look, if someone had an expensive watch and took out a hammer and smashed it and then turned to you and said, Huh, I seem to have broken my watch. Please buy me a new one. Do you think you would? Probably not. And this is basically the same case, only the watch is a pair of lungs and the hammer is 80,000 packs of export A's. And, and, and not only do, do we pay for these people, but they clog up the system so that when other people fall ill due to genuine misfortune, they have to wait longer for treatment. Smokers are like cholesterol in an already slow-moving bloodstream. I say we take some Lipitor and get them out. It's, it, it's not like I want smokers to just die. Like, I'm, I'm not a jerk, and, and it's not like smokers are the only people who do things that have poor medical outcomes. You know, like some people drink and drive. Y you know who you are, Dad. You know, or, or, or what about people who bungee jump or parachute out of airplanes, i.e. psychos? You know, or, or people who eat a lot of fast food and then have heart attacks. Or like, I guess based on my argument, I could say that if, if I went skiing and broke my leg, th then maybe I shouldn't have gone skiing. Y you know, if I, if I cross the street and get hit by a car, Hey, maybe I shouldn't have gone outside that day. Maybe I should be held accountable for my actions, too. You know, maybe we should all just stay in our apartments and only eat vegetables and tofu and try not to move too much just in case we stub our toes or fell, fall down the stairs. You know, like, maybe I'm being too hard on smokers. They have rights, too. You know, they have the right to wheeze and to have bad breath. And, and at least smokers contribute to the system by, by paying a crap load of taxes on their cigarettes. You, you know, in fact, oh, my God, they put so much money into the system, they almost deserve the health care. You know, actually, they pay so much tax that, that if they die without getting a smoking-related illness, then, you know, their family should probably get a free trip to Disneyland or something. You know, like, n now I'm confused. This, this is confusing now. You know, like, smoking is stupid, but we all do bad stuff. You know, so, so now I don't know what to think. Like, I, I don't, I don't, I just, th this has actually become a really stressful argument. I don't, I don't know what to think.